The author of The Great Gatsby is Francis Scott Key Fitzgerald. He was born on September 24, 1896 in St. Paul, Minnesota. His father was an unsuccessful businessman, so the family lived off of Fitzgerald's mother's sizable inheritance. His mother's wealth provided opportunities for young Fitzgerald to mingle with the social elite in his hometown. But it wasn't quite enough for him to be accepted into the highest class of the social hierarchy. Like Nick's character, Fitzgerald left Minnesota for an Ivy League education. Fitzgerald attended Princeton, joined the Army, and later moved to New York City. When he was 22 years old, he fell in love with socialite Zelda Sayre. Although Zelda claimed to love Fitzgerald, she refused to marry him until he was rich. It wasn't until Fitzgerald published his first novel, This Side of Paradise, in 1920, that Zelda deemed him appropriate to marry. As his writing career blossomed, he and Zelda enjoyed their celebrity with lavish parties, heavy drinking, and extensive travels. However, this lifestyle came with a price. For years, Fitzgerald struggled with alcoholism and depression, which wreaked havoc on his career and health. Ultimately, these factors contributed to the heart attack that killed him on December 21, 1940, at the age of 44. Many aspects of Fitzgerald's life are mirrored in The Great Gatsby. Details are scattered throughout his work in the form of character traits, story settings, and conflicts. When The Great Gatsby was first released, it received mediocre reviews and sold poorly. By the time of Fitzgerald's death, the author was largely forgotten. When the U.S. entered the Second World War, they gave copies of The Great Gatsby to soldiers to improve their morale. In 1944, The Great Gatsby had sold 120 copies. Today, the book regularly sells 500,000 copies per year.